A community is uh, reeling after someone shot a student from Cedar Hill High, even though it happened off campus at someone's home. Devon Fernandez spoke with a parent and city council member, and they're both concerned. Cedar Hill ISD is letting parents know there may be a heightened sense of security this week back here at the high school after one of its students was involved in an off campus shooting. More officers may be roaming around Cedar Hill High School. It's a measure the district's taking out of an abundance of caution. That's according to high school principal Jason Miller in a letter sent to parents on Wednesday. The precautionary measures are being taken after an unidentified student was shot late Tuesday night. Sources say the shooting happened outside this house on Thornton Drive. Neighbors describe it as a house that's been the target of shootings before. Local police are being tight-lipped about the details surrounding that shooting right now, but some community members are speaking out. I've been a child advocate for over 44 years. Local Councilwoman Shirley Daniels and parent Shamega Austin call the senseless violence off campus concerning. School board, I hope you're listening to me. I have pleaded with you all to get male detectors. The women say they don't want the school district to ever risk an off-campus issue impacting safety in its middle and high schools. Austin says her biggest fear. Retaliation on campus. Uh, that is my biggest fear because we don't know if that's the end. For now, police have not yet released any updates on the injured student's status, but sources say the teen's in recovery. Cedar Hill High School will also have more counselors should students need to talk. In his letter, the principal is assuring parents all students are safe on campus. In Cedar Hill, I'm Damon Fernandez.